And welcome back to Craig WK Longplay. We're, uh... Can I remember what we were doing? I guess we're just... Going to assault the main fortress at this point, I guess. Come on! It's a lot of dragons. That's a lot of dead dragons! Oh yeah, meteor strike. Pity it didn't happen first, but you know, whatever. <laughs> it annihilates everything. Oh man. Check this out. A book of flame was found. Well, if it ain't a book of meteors, then it ain't worth it. Hey, I liberated Docel. I liberated Sarisk. Oh, uh, Dio, what are you doing? I mean, you know, you don't gotta do all the work, but, you know, get in there. Uh... <laughs> Running away? Oh, no, he's going to meet me on the road. I need to rest. Huh, I was hoping to, uh... Europia. Might have to have somebody else assault that fortress. Like Ankaseth, apparently. <laughs> I enc I've encountered the enemy. Ankaseth, you wanna, like, settle down? You're kinda just waltzing on in there. Alright, never mind. Yeah, you can handle it. Yeah, that's a creepy doll. I'll accept the steadfast while you were alive and drop. You were fighting golems. Your life didn't drop for destroying a golem. Okay, now what's up? Agassiz just waltzing right past it. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, break camp. And... I mean... Really didn't want Europia, like, going and fighting and dying. What needs to be taken care of next? Alright, so... Oh, man, she used, uh, uh... I think she used an item to prevent, uh... Alright, I'm here. What's next? Alright. Dio's going to camp for just a few moments. But she is totally going after that main enemy, and uh, I don't want her to die, because she probably will. Alright. Dio's done resting up. Dio will assault the base. I trust him. It's almost the same as if Magnus is there. They're buddies. They're bros. Let's get it on. Fourier. Why do you interfere? What's your intention? Our only order was to eliminate the fallen lamb. Why then do you interfere? You too? Do you intend to overthrow the Eastern Orthodox Church with the power of the devil? So it is true, just as Sir Karakov said. No, it's the Central Division who's plotting to overthrow the Church. Don't let them deceive you. You expect me to trust you? Infidels, in the name of our mother Berth Bertha, I, I'll destroy you. Hmm. Wasn't exactly what I wanted. Alright, fair enough. Hooray! Our new friend didn't go into fight. Die. Hey, sort of dragon gem. That sounds cool. Hooray. Why 
Why? Why has my god forsaken me? I don't remember what voice I gave her now. <laughs> god watches over everything. She does not exist for the benefit of any one person. Keep your ramblings to yourself. No matter what kind of power you hold, you won't stand a chance against the ultimate power. If you expect to move on, you better prepare for the worst. She didn't seem to know anything. I don't think we can go further by ourselves. Magnus, though it may not be much, we will do the best we can to help you. Would you allow us to join the Revolutionary Army? Certainly. In fact, our intelligence on the Eastern Orthodox Church is seriously lacking. It would help us greatly if you could tell us anything about the Church. Thank you. I will let tell you everything I know. Oh man, that one path is gone! Well, hopefully I made the right choice. Let's see what we got going on here. Is she just a random soldier or does she have her own unit? No, she just a... Meridia. Siren. Oh, did I not add her in? I could have sworn I added her in. Is there anyone who has a just a soldier? Anyone who needs somebody? No? Okay. is level 20. That is not going to cut it. Uh, level 19, Pit, Fox, Minerva, Crodia. Well, she's got decent units. And they're all pretty lawful, which is kind of nice. What's her friend here? Uh, oh, she's a little on the chaotic side. Alright, fair enough. Meridia is going on a crazy unit. <laughs> going on one of them crazy evil units. Um, Alright, how do we want to do this? Oh, you know what? Let's get rid of uh, some of our zombies. Oops. Alright, so... Unit commands, form unit, add character, remove character. Zombies haven't been doing a whole lot. So, we're going to remove... Gene, I guess. Add a character. Oh, uh, yeah, to their unit. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, let's see. Formation. There we go. So we're gonna get him on the front lines. Just check the status first, so I know how she operates. Okay, so... Oh, well, even in the middle, she'll uh, launch two of those ice fields. Alright, well, that's good enough for me. Oops, alright, so... Uh, add character, remove character... Formation, there we go. Boom. There we go. And then... Go ahead and use a whole bunch of these uh, champion statuettes. Because uh, she's going to... Oh, I mean, if, if she joined us at level... If Meridia joined us at around level 20-ish, in 1819 or whatever, then she's that's that should be about on average where we should be. And everyone's level 50. So I feel like, like, for the rest of the game, we're just going to utterly destroy everything. Unless, uh, well, then again, so in some RPGs, characters will join at a lower level. So maybe we should be around in the like, early 20s or something. Oh. 
Ice Blast is in the middle. Ice Field is in the rear, which I think is the, uh, the spell that'll uh, do a lot more. Huh. Uh, maybe we do want her in the back. Maybe we'll put her in the corner with... Uh, and then put uh, Old Man Kane in the other corner. Because his meteor swarms hit everybody anyway. It doesn't really matter what side of the field he's on, I don't think. And then we'll pump up our uh, new friend Europia. Euro Europia? Europe Europia. I think it's Europia. Uh, I could feasibly try to switch out her spell book, but I guess ice magic is just as good as any other. Well, she is, uh, has that water element sign. I wonder if that's just a fancy way of saying, like, when you equip a spell book, it's just that's your element. Hmm. There's just so little I know about this game, even at this point. Which, you know, I could learn and do better, but, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, she's got crazy high magic defense. That's great. I feel like there's there's almost like I mean aside aside from the fact that it's broken because I'm cheating, but like I feel like you just slap some really really tough dudes on the front line, and then at that point, like what really pierces to them into the mages in the back? I guess you can feasibly hit uh, use magic to hit the people on the front line. I guess. I guess it just sort of depends on how you're placed and what enemies are around. Anyway, uh, so there should be, uh, where is it, uh, Battle Street, carry item. Our new unit with Europia there, we need to give her a couple of ultras for resurrection, and uh, what else do we want to give? Uh, oh, we should probably... Oh, Crystal Precision, that's another new one. Cup of Life. Cup that increases hit points of the one who drinks from it. Crystal Precision. Green Crystal that heightens a character's concentration and raises dexterity. Goblet of Destiny. Oh, it alters destiny. We knew that one. Okay. Well, not that it really gives us a whole lot to go on. Uh, hmm. I feel like there were other items that we had. Something, something, curing people of petrification. Ah, well, whatever. Uh, oh, and... Whoa, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Right, good enough. I don't think it'll ever be needed, but... Uh, and then get her on the front line. She can do slash attacks. Feasibly with a lot more power in the front row. Although, well, we can check that out, actually. Yeah, I guess wherever she's at, she's slashing. Two slashes in the front, more damage. Works for me. Thunder Flare in the back. I'm okay with that. Well, then I'm not okay with those levels, so... Let's just go ahead and cheat a whole bunch. Uh, carry item. No. There it is. Item command. Use item. Yeah, there we are. Herd of chaos. If only I had an item that made people awful, I wouldn't wouldn't be uh, <laughs> I wouldn't be uh, capturing those uh, lawful cities instead of uh, uh, instead of uh, liberating them. But you know, whatever. How many do I have? Sixty-five. Perfect. Well, not perfect. We'll have to. Do a quick cheat at some point here to level everybody in this unit up, I think, but that's okay. Oh, she counts as a Centurion. Isn't that a really defensive unit? So I thought they called her an Astral Knight. Interesting. She's pretty heavily armored. Got a shield and everything, so... Oh, no matter, at level 50 she'll annihilate everything she touches anyway. So, let's go ahead. Cheat a whole bunch. We 
lament the fact that we, uh, you know, lost uh, our dragon units. Well, not lost our dragon units. Uh, what did I want to say? Uh, lament the fact we only have one dra- or... Yes, lament the fact we only had one dragon, and the fact that the monster units I have, like zombies, don't seem to do anything. They just stay zombies. Such a shame. Such a pity. I could have totally stood to have, like, super zombies or something. That would have been cool. Oh, well. Oh, I got a fancy new unit, which looks pretty tough. Europia is pretty cool. Even if I think I've given her, like, three different voices at this point, when she was first introduced, when we first saw her, and then when we jumped back in and, uh, in this episode, and I had a brain fart and couldn't remember what voice I gave her. Just way too many characters in this game. Alright. She's almost at level 50. I could feasibly only raise her to 50, leave everyone behind, and then... Eh, might as well. Okay. Here you go, Pit. Oh, if you slap him in the back row, he does healing. Oh, he's got a blessed sword. That's probably why. Yeah, because I think certain classes, if you... I'm pretty sure that's how it works, because I'm pretty sure when I gave the fire sword or whatever it was to... Uh, I was it was like a lightning sword to Dio. He was suddenly doing lightning attacks from the back row if he was there. Oh, well, whatever. Let's hope I can actually remember how to do the... Uh, the item trick. It, you'd think I would totally remember it, but every time I go to do it, I just suddenly feel like I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh man, he slashes three times in the front row. Paladins rule. That's crazy. Yeah, this unit's gonna be awesome. And they're lawful, which is nice. Because aside from what, uh, Magnus... Dio's kind of been neutral lately because his units are starting to, to go down a dark path. Uh, and Ankaseth, Ankaseth is uh, uh, seems pretty lawful, I think. Uh, aside from that, though, uh, the only other really lawful unit I had was uh, uh, oh, what's her name? Uh, I'm suddenly forgetting her name. Uh, nah, she's like a cleric or something. I usually have her. On base duty because her unit wasn't really super powerful, but now that she's level 50, honestly, it doesn't matter. Really doesn't matter anymore. Uh, let's be careful, make sure I'm not gonna use too many of these champion statuettes so I don't run out of them. And now we'll have another unit, which will typically hang out and do nothing? I have no idea. Go pit the paladin. And fox the paladin. Oh, that's cool, I guess. Alright. Let's go ahead, polish these off. We'll do our cheap. Okay. Now, one left, so we're good there. So let's go ahead and uh, take out... Uh, Okay, so... Oh, Aisha. Uh, Aisha there is, uh... Aisha? Yeah, Aisha. Well, nah, whatever. Uh, yeah, she's the one. So, remove character. Uh... I guess our buddy here. That's fine. Saradin. So, we go ahead and... Form a unit. Soldier, I think this is how we do it. And then we go to carry item. Yeah, this sounds right. Champion statuette. And then we go 
to remove character. Pretty sure. Switch out the item. And then we go to item commands. Then we go to, uh, no, not you, sell. We want to sell two of these guys. I think. Pretty sure. Let's find out. Uh, yeah, seems right. Awesome, so... 50, oops, 50, 23, there we go. Wonderful. Go ahead. Cheat a whole bunch here, which I think we'll have to cheat one more time, honestly. So we only got 55 out of this one, so whatever. No biggie. I usually kind of sort of stumble my way through uh, getting those items, so that's all that matters. So, we just go ahead. And use the sweet, sweet power of magic statues to uh, you know, raise up Fox, my new best friend. He's just. He's just. He's a great guy, with the, those yellow downward arrows and his, his slight tip to lawfulness and that, that shiny metal with the red, red felt. He's just a great guy. Alright. Now let's go ahead and cheat a whole bunch. And cheat some more. Oh lord, this is so boring. <laughs> <laughs> Cheating is so boring. All right. Oh, let's just go ahead and finish this up. Oh, I right. actually no. I'm pretty sure uh, these are the only. Yeah, these are the paladins we have. Probably because most of our units are a little on the unlawful side. But uh, even uh, Ankaset didn't start with paladins. He uh, started with those. Uh, uh, oh, what are they called? Cataphracts. Of course, cataphracts. Level 50. Minerva. Who will probably not even hit 50? Uh, just barely hit? No, yeah, not even gonna hit 50. That's fine, whatever. I don't want it to be that easy anyway, so this is perfect. Great. Although it's kind of weird to me that... Is that weird? I feel like the... Uh, uh, Europia's uh, units are all lawful. But she's real neutral. That's just weird to me. Hmm. Oh well. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter. I mean, you know, not really anyway. I wonder if, uh, oh no, that's right, I was, I was about to ask if, uh, uh, if a paladin, like, loses his morality, like, drops into chaos, like, if he becomes one of those dark knights, but, uh, but no, the, the game system is just like, hey, if you change your class, you can't go back to being the, you know, whatever you were before because of your alignment shift, so, so feasibly, you could have an evil paladin, you can, you could totally make a paladin, have him be lawful, and then just have him do rotten, terrible things, which, Incidentally, it's not usually that rotten and terrible. I don't understand this game. I can only imagine it's like the level disparity is like the game's way is just being like, you know, hey man, this is, you're bullying them. Which I kind of get, but another part of me is like, well, if you over-level yourself, mind you, I'm doing it by 
like cheating. But like if you over level yourself, like you can't really help it. Like you have to continue through the game at some point. All right, so I think that is it. Yes, one left, perfect. So let's go ahead and uh, unit commands. Go ahead and is that right? No. Can we remove it? No, of course we can't. All right, so go to item commands, move item. One items will be unequipped. Yep, perfect. Formation. Add a stupid soldier to crazy old man Saradin's battalion there. Wonderful. Carry item. Saradin, carry this champion statuette. But only in the bottom slot. And then... Remove character. Boom. Have Saradin switch that out for... I don't know, power fruit or whatever it is. And then go to item command, sell, two of those, oh, exit, head back in. Item command, use item. Let's just go ahead and hey, 99 of them. Perfect. Now we'll have enough left over so I don't have to bother doing the cheat again. So let's just go ahead and finish this up. And then we'll go ahead and pause there. Uh, I hope that I've not missed, uh, and you know, any of our, our you know, uh, watchers and anyone following the series and anyone who uh, uh, just knows the game well enough uh, can I'm sure to let me know of course but uh, you know I hope I'm not missing a lot of like really integral characters or something I feel like I've done pretty well like you know every few missions I feel like we're snagging either one person or even an entire unit you know to join us uh, so hopefully uh, you know I haven't uh, missed uh, missed anybody uh, really important I uh, you know, somebody who's going <laughs> to make or break the ending to this game. Because <laughs> I'm going to be really, really sad if we get to the all the way to the end. All the way. And then it turns out we missed something. It was just something dumb. Just something stupid that I totally could have gotten. So, something I, I, you know, might not have missed. And it just ruined it. But I'm hoping that that's not the case. I I'm, I think I'm in the clear. I feel like I'm doing pretty good. To the best of my knowledge, the gist of getting a good ending is that you are, you know, chaotic. Or, not cha not chaotic. That you're lawful. And we liberate most cities, and I feel like I make some pretty honorable decisions when the decisions come up. So, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see. Because I, you know, feel like the game's coming to a close here God, probably pretty soon. I think it's four chapters long. We're on the third chapter. So, you know, a fair amount of missions left. But, uh, but you know, I feel like it's coming to a close here pretty soon. So, And maybe I'm totally crazy. Maybe I read it wrong that there are, you know, four chapters. Or maybe there's a whole bunch of missions in the fourth chapter that I don't know about yet. Uh, so... Uh, you know, uh, let me know in the comments, though. Uh, did I miss anybody? Uh, you know, did I totally flake on, you know, one of your favorite characters? I make a stupid decision to do it. Uh, you know, uh, just go ahead and keep me posted. Uh, but otherwise, uh, I do appreciate, you know, everyone uh, watching along with the series. Uh, we're going to go ahead and pause here, of course. Uh, yeah, make sure to, uh, if you, you know, if you are enjoying the series, drop a like. Make sure you're subscribed. Uh, leave me a comment, of course. Uh, you know, if this is, uh, like, your, totally your video game and I'm stumbling my way through it, well, you know, just, uh, let me know, uh, uh, you know, what I should be looking out for, what I'm missing. Let's get rid of Saturday. Uh, we're gonna slap together our 
unit here, and uh, yeah. Uh, otherwise, uh, make sure to check out uh, GameZillaMedia.com, where uh, myself and my team members' projects all are. Uh, otherwise, we're going to go ahead and assault this, this castle, uh, Capitri uh, Capitrium, Capitrium, the land of Advent next time. Uh, not sure where that other one went to, but whatever. Uh, yeah. Doing, uh, hope you enjoy the series, of course, and, uh, uh, thanks for watching.